We are here for the Tron preview. The Polynesian. Really, <laughs> No, we are here for the Tron preview. I'm so excited. Five it's finally years happening. Finally yeah. happening. Five years. We are here with our friends Brooke and her brother Chase. Washed up. Yeah. Washed up. <laughs> Washed up. <laughs> Don't mind him. But we are here waiting to get on the ferry. And we'll see you guys in a little bit. Wow. Oh, no. We have finally made it. Woo! So as you can see, there's the um, the time board, which is newly installed and is not on there. He said a walk on. Yeah. Well, we'll see if it's a walk on. Let's see. Oh. Oh, oh, boy. Right here, we do have the test seats, and we're gonna show you guys how it fits. Ah. So, as you can see, that's how you sit. And you just push down, you push back. If they have it locked on. <laughs> and it locks you in. Here we go, guys. We're inside. For your safety, remain seated on your light cycle. Wow. Keep restraints securely fastened. Supervise young team crew users. Hi, Ashley. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Attention users, you are about to be digitized into the world of Tron. For your safety in this world, all users should be in good health. You should be free from high blood pressure, heart, back, or leg problems. You should be free from motion sickness or other Prepare to be digitized into the world of Tron. Now here comes the real time of the line. Yeah. So if anybody's wondering, they actually said the locker room should be up here closely. We have not gotten there yet. 
supervise young Team Blue users at all times. Para su seguridad, permanezca sentado en su life cycle en todo momento. Manténgala para los espacios de upload conduit and onto the grid. Your opponent is going to be there. To win, every member of Team Blue must pass through eight energy gates before their opponents. Stick together. It's your only hope for victory. In the life cycle run, there are winners and there are losers. Who are you? Ashley picked it up. Let's see. Let me. Let's see. I don't know if I have my magic ring on, but let's try. Wow. Uh -oh. Well, you know what? If you see this, this is a good example. If you see this, it's oh. <laughs> wow. So if you did what I did, um, it's open to be ready. And we are locked in, ready to go. Let's. Uh, if you don't have a magic ring or you need some assistance, they do have this right next to the locker system. So right after you exit the locker system, it throws you right into the loading bay. And the good thing is they have a left and a right loading bay. So the times are pretty quick. Times are really pretty quick. And it seems like Maybe two trains have the, um, the accessibility one in the back, the accessibility car in the back. Uh, so these two trains don't have it yet. So I'm pretty sure like two trains out, maybe like the four they're running today. But it's pretty big in here. It looks pretty big. It's, it's pretty spacious. Okay, so one thing I did notice doing the test seat is that it felt very similar to Flight of Passage when I walked the legs in place. The only difference I felt was like I was feeling more leaned over. Like you're gonna pull yourself forward more like sure. you're gonna lay down. And another difference between this and Friday Pass is there's a bar. Uh, Friday Pass the bar comes up to your ankles. Yeah. This one is gonna be a bar that's gonna come up to your calf. Yes. So it's yeah. gonna be a little bit different. Yeah. That's one thing I wanted to say to let you guys know. And if you can't clear like a little metal bar that comes up between your calf area if you can't really clear that they do have a sit down accessibility non-bike one oh, I did not know that. yeah so again i think maybe only two trains have it so far i have not yet seen one on here so you're on your own road on your own side i know absolutely. i was getting ready to walk right behind you and i was like oh wait a minute <laughs> Right here is the loading procedure. So Ashley's gonna go right on, and then I have to go up behind the vehicle and go on the other side. So it's a little bit different, but not too complicated. But oh, we are just moments away, you guys. I'm so excited. 
excited. <laughs> it's finally happening. Yes. After so many years. True. And we didn't have to go all the way up to Shanghai for it. No, we got to stay at home. True. And then these guys over here. Yeah, he, he's just shaking it, shaking it, shaking it, shaking it, shaking it. Shaking it. Yeah, boy. He's so excited. <laughs> Yes, let's go. Alright, so we just got off of Tron, Life Cycle Run. What did everybody think? That was legit. I, I really liked it. Legit. Yo, hashtag legit. <laughs> <laughs> it was pretty fun. What got me was, I didn't know we was going to sit in that low. Right above us, you can't see that's Tron. No, Chase, it's actually, Tron is actually back there. <laughs> we are over here, away from the crowd. Um, but other than that, I think the best part of the ride for me is the ride along. I think the beginning yeah. is definitely the most impactful. The more shocking part for me was like, when you get inside. I didn't expect to see what I what I saw. Oh yeah, the big screens. It's kind of like Guardians yeah. with the, the big screen. It's not on the same scale as Guardians, but it's there. Um, I noticed we got a little preview, but I will say the audio for our ride was a little bit too loud. It was like a Metallica concert in there, so I guess it, you know let's, let's tweak that a little bit down. But other than all, I think the best part was again the launch. The launch in the beginning, the whole scene and being surrounded by that blue glowing light and it's like and all the other features are black it just pops and it's just so impactful and I, it's just so amazing it really was now the downfall of the ride way too short very yeah. short um, I, you know you blink a couple times and then you're already done with the ride yes. you know it's just so yeah keep your eyes open but overall I give this a uh, I say seven seven and a half seven. wow yeah. uh, I was gonna say an 8.8 .8, but okay <laughs> Oh, wow. I only give it that much because the only 10 out of 10 that I can give in Disney is Pigment. Uh, Pigment! Pigment! But yeah, so seriously though, <laughs> <laughs> I will say I give it a 7 because of how short the ride is. Like it does have these impactful moments, but it's just like it's not enough for me. It really isn't. I, I need to be longer. Yeah. You know? And we could not get more today. Oh, yeah, yeah. We only have one ride. Um, I'm still sticking with my 8.8, .8, even though it's short. But you can actually feel some of the G forces. It's, it's not as crazy, but it's up there between, yeah, I'll say, Rock and Roller Coaster and Guardians. Now, over and all, we're getting kicked out. Yeah. And uh, so. stay tuned until the next video. Ring that bell, smash that subscribe button for the six-month update on our review. <laughs> yeah, we could do a re review. <laughs> if, you don't, Actually, yeah. if you don't subscribe and ring that bell, bing, bing. you'll miss it. Bing, bing. <laughs> and you, you want to see it. You want to see it. Alright. Alright. There we have it, folks. <laughs> Thanks for watching. I'm Darius. I'm Ashley. I'm Brooke. I'm Chase. And like you said, ring, ring.